all making our accent seasoning because we're not going to really buy that. It has a lot of uh, MSG and I don't really want to buy it because we're not really going to use it that much. But we're going to make a substitution for that. Here we go. One tablespoon of coriander. These are not exact measurements. I don't really do that. I try to do it with bacon, but yeah. I'm a black chick from the south. <laughs> a half a teaspoon of turmeric. The annatto powder. Four teaspoon of annatto powder. Full tablespoon of garlic powder. One good thing about making it is that you know what's in it. Instead of having all that MSG, just make it with everything else. And you can substitute for the um, MSG, which is usually like an amame flavor. So just use the mushroom powder, the uh, green mango powder. That'll definitely work. Some salt. We're not going to use all of this... Uh, Mix up a substitute accent seasoning, but we'll just mix it together and then use a little bit of it, and then I can have some sitting on my counter for later. So we won't have to do so much mixing. And I need some oregano. Ah, hold on, oregano. Now, a tablespoon of oregano, which mine is in clump little. Uh, bits so what we're going to do is just crush it up in my hand and put it in there so that way we don't have to use our mortar and pester today because we got a lot of dishes y'all <laughs> happy go get on me about all these dishes that goes in there And our mushroom seasoning. And for this, we're only going to do about a half. Let's just do three fourths. I really don't want to do a full uh, teaspoon of that. Tablespoon. Three fourths of a uh, teaspoon. I don't want to do a full teaspoon of that. It's very strong seasoning, so you don't need a whole lot. Now, the green mango powder. We're only going to do a half of a teaspoon of it. Oh my gosh, it's very clumpy on the top. I haven't used this one, I think, in a while. Green mango powder. There we go. Gonna mix this up pretty good here. the clumps out. Maybe I should have used my mortar and pesto. I don't want to get that out today. sure you get all the little clumps so you don't get like spots of just overpowering flavor of anything. Yeah, there we go. Good old accent seasoning without the MSG.
go. Accent seasoning without the MSG.